Okay, email groups. To get to your email groups, go to email and then email groups. Now what exactly is an email group? An email group is a group of emails tied to a single email address. So, for instance, this is my one of my default patrol groups, leadership.troop123virginia. And when an email is sent from anywhere, it can be from your Hotmail account or your Gmail account or from within the Troopmaster software, when an email is sent to leadership.troop123virginia at troopmaster.email, each one of these individuals will get that email message. Now, the default groups are monitored by the software for you. And if a new scout is added to one of your patrols, they will also be added to your default email group. And so will their parents, if include parents is selected. And your members group, members.troop123 Virginia at troopmaster.email. You can set that up so we don't have that group. So it's just the adults and scouts, or it's the adult, scouts, and parents. You can also create your own group. So I just created a group, test.troop123virginia. And let's say when someone sends an email to that address, I want to receive the email. And I don't want to pick individual members from my database. What I want to do in this case is select by adult leadership position. You also have scout positions available as well. But in this case, let's say I want to send to some of my adult positions. I want the email sent to my advancement chair, my assistant scoutmaster, and the scoutmaster. I'm going to click save. Now this takes about five minutes or so for this group to get added to our email server. But in about five minutes, you'll be able to send an email to test.troop123virginia at troopmaster.email and each one of these individuals would get that email. You'll also notice under email when you go to compose a message, click on the two box. Email groups is one of the options in your filter. So you can send an email to your test group right here. If you want to delete this group, simply highlight it and click delete. Now you can't delete the default groups that we create for you. If you don't want those in the system any longer, you have to click on default groups and then click on none. 